What did it mean to you to see a guy that you've known for so long, played with for so long, have such a history and a friendship with, be up there and say goodbye to the game of baseball? Yeah, it's it's surreal, you know, going through uh, being done myself. And then, uh, you know, I just, I still remember when we were kids and, you know, and I, when I first came up 13 years ago, whatever, 14 years ago, whatever it was, or that, that it, it seems like yesterday. And, uh, you know, to, to be at the end and, and to see that, you know, I just, um, it, it's crazy. It, it really is. And, you know, it just, it shows you how short our careers are and that, and that the game just keeps going. And uh, guys come in, guys come out, but I think he left a pretty good mark on the game and on this organization and all the players that were here and all the players that weren't here. He's left a, quite a mark on all those guys. Two kids from the same area getting drafted by their hometown team and getting to play their whole careers with that organization. That does not happen very often, if at all. But you two are those guys. How special is that to you? It, it, very special. And I, I think he said it today, and, and I made a point throughout my career to, to do what I could to stay here as well. That I never, once I got the opportunity to play here, I never wanted to go play anywhere else, and I wouldn't. And, uh, you know, I, I, I had opportunities to play last year, but I wasn't going to play anywhere else. And, and you know, you just... It becomes so much a part of who you are. Um, and, uh, you know, to be able to share that with him, I, I think is pretty cool. Um, you know, we never got to get to the highest level, which is, is I think, the one disappointment. But, uh, you know, to be able to play as long as we did together, 12 years in the big leagues, um, is, is pretty cool. And you were there with him through the transition of getting from behind the plate over to first base, and you saw that transition in him. What does that say about just how talented and the kind of athlete that he is that he was able to excel at both yeah he's I mean he's he's one of the best athletes I ever played with um, no question and uh, yeah I mean he he, he was a, a, as good of a catcher as you could throw to and and then he went over and, and ended up playing a gold glove caliber first base um, you know in just a couple years time and uh, you know it, it's it's incredible what he was able to do and, and the injuries that he went through and the head injuries and the body injuries and still be able to hit the way he did. I mean, one of those things could happen to another guy and they're done. They're never the same. And and he, he you know, a month into his first season, he hurt his knee and ended up having this career and, and being able to do all the things and catch as long as he did. Um, you know, it's incredible. He's incredible and, and he's a legend. And that's kind of what legends do. What's the future hold for the two of you as friends? I know you guys have bonded over being from the same area, playing for the same organization, fatherhood. Now he's got another one on the way. What's the future hold for the two of you as you continue your friendship? I'm sure he's going to want to do some hunting. He's it's, he's probably out for this year, I think, <laughs> with with another kid on the way imminently. So maybe that's next year. But I know he's always he's always talked to me. I do with some woodworking stuff, and he's always talked to me about that. And and I think I, I'll be waiting for a phone call from him to have him probably help me help have me help him set up a, a wood shop of some sort. I'm sure. And and. Uh, you know, that's kind of been an interesting thing that we've talked about over the years. But uh, I know for right now, uh, you know, if you need some parenting lessons, I guess. Now, he's got more than me, so I can't even give him those. But um, he's got his hands full right now. And, and uh, you know, in time, I'm sure he'll get, get through that. And, and hopefully we'll uh, be able to spend some time together. Awesome. Perk, it's good to see you. Best of luck with everything. And enjoy your retirement along with Joel. Thank you very much.